Alright, so this is the bike incident number uno doso. No, it wouldn't be uno doso. Just say that. That's, I, I think that's 12. I don't know, but who cares? Um, so the bike incident. My friend had an old mini bike. Like, it was just like a this tall, this tall at its peak and at its lowest just mini bike that was just sitting in his garage for I think five years and then I found it and I started working on it and working on it and then had some help and replaced a few parts and got it w running again at least and so um, there's a, kid, a family that lives down there from my house and so I was riding it through there on, I think on a Saturday and my aunt from Arizona was coming into town and I was showing it off and riding around on it and of course I didn't have a helmet being stupid as I am as I said in the other bike incident being as stupid as I am I didn't have a helmet on which is probably a bad thing but I was riding it through town riding through the neighborhood and there's seven, eight-year-old kids, 12-year-old kids that are like, dude, can I ride that? And I was like, no, this thing goes like 45 miles, not 45, 30 miles an hour. I was exaggerating for them so they wouldn't, like, try and kill themselves. And so they um, were like, but please, I'll go really slow. And I was like, no, I'm not going to let you do it. And so I was riding through the neighborhood, totally illegal, by the way not registered, not uh, street legal, I was totally riding it in the middle street. Like, the boss that I am, I was trying to say bad A, but I didn't, I, I wanted to keep my videos not vulgar for at least a little while. Um, so then, uh, I was riding it down like a boss, just breaking the odds, just be like, oh, we got a bad A over here. Totally just broke my arm around. Um, so then, uh, the, one of the seven-year-old kids that was there really, really wanted to ride it. He, like, grabbed the handle from me and tried to get it, even though I had the brake on. And the back brake was broken, too. The mold for it was broken, so I couldn't, like, back brake, so I had to, like, slow down and use the front brake. So if I used the front brake and I was just going really, really fast... Uh, it would just like flip me over the bike and I would crash just the same as I did. Just gave away the ending. Rewind. Don't hear that. Just like plug out your headphones for a second there. Just rewind and just don't listen to that. And so uh, he really wanted to ride it and then I rode away and like five minutes later the kid was still there playing with his neighbor at, so he hears me coming and I wrote, ride past, just about to ride past, and I uh, come around the corner and the kid sees me coming, going like 30 miles an hour, not 30, like 15 miles an hour, and he walks out into the street with a bat, a bat. Like, not the animal, a baseball bat. Like, a real baseball bat. Walks out on the middle street, tries to hit me with it. I swerve, because my front brake didn't work, or my back brake didn't work, so I couldn't slow down in time. And so I, try, I swerve to avoid him, and the bike went from this to this in a matter of milliseconds and I was on the ground rolling and probably not a good idea because that was pretty terrible luckily his mom was a nurse and so I really wanted to swear at this kid I really wanted to but I refrain because um, I refrained so I got up Left the bike in the middle of the street, got up, walked down in the 
and uh, was like, what the heck, man? Totally like surfer dude tone. And uh, so then I, did, I wasn't bleeding or anything. Uh, he was like, oh, 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 I'm so sorry. And so I was like, dude, just, just stay away. And so I lay down in the house that I crashed in front of, lay down in their uh, lawn, and the mom of that house comes out and he was like, oh, or she was like, oh, you get, you crashed on it? You, could, you look pretty bad. And I was like, oh, I feel like crap. And so then the kid runs into his house and he, he was like, to his mom, he totally just messes up my name. Uh, my name's... Jacob Dixon, just FYI, he goes into his house and he was like, Jacob Erickson just fell off his bike. Jacob Erickson just fell off his bike. And, uh, she's so, blah, 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 blah. so she's like, what? 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 And so she runs outside and, um, then, um, like, gets, like, saline and stuff, like, cleans me out. But I have battle wounds. Hand. Hand. I got a smiley face scar on my elbow. If you guys can see that, probably can't. Oh yeah, he smiley face. Whoosh. And then I have one on my knee that's bad. Look at that. That. I'll zoom it in for you. Oh no. What? Okay. Just push something on my camera. It was just like white and red and it was just nasty. And so, yeah. I didn't go to the hospital this time though. Luckily. But probably not a good idea for seven year olds to walk out in the street with a bat and try to hit someone on a motorcycle going 15 miles an hour. Luckily, my front tire didn't come off, though. That was a plus. That was a reference to my other bike story. If you guys haven't watched that, go watch that. It's a good story. I totally embarrassed myself. So, thanks for watching these videos. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves to my, uh, my excruciating pain. Have a nice day. None of you posted what I wanted to see, what you guys wanted me to say at the end of a vlog. So, yeah. Oh gosh. Bye, William. William the giraffe says bye.